Do not eat bread, make this breakfast with only three ingredients. I'll start our recipe by grating a carrot. Tell me your favorite breakfast recipe, I'd love to know. I'm sure you'll love this one. I'll put 170 grams of tuna on top of a sieve. The goal is to remove excess liquid from the can. Do it at your house and then come back here to tell me what you think. In a bowl, I will put the carrot that we grated. I will also add two eggs, the tuna we sifted, and I'm gonna mix it real good. I think this recipe is amazing and I make it every week. Let's add 100 grams of mozzarella, a teaspoon of salt, and half a teaspoon of black pepper. And before I forget, tell me which city you're watching so I can send you a special hug. Today's hug goes to Ingrid Sanasil from South Africa. I'm glad you're enjoying our recipes. Now I will add some olive oil inside a pan. I'm sure everyone will love it. I'll transfer the mixture we prepared into the pot. Using a spoon we will spread well to make everything uniform. Then I will cover and cook for 10 minutes. After this time with the help of a dish I will turn our omelette to cook equally on both sides. If necessary, you can also add a little more olive oil. I'm sure you'll get into your routine just as you got into mine. With a few ingredients from day to day we managed to make a great option for breakfast. It's much tastier than just eating a regular bun. Again, we will cook for 5 minutes. And our recipe was already ready, look what delight was. It's so good that when I do it, there's never anything left. It is a great option for those who do not have much time to cook. Best of all, you can eat with another food as our omelet goes with everything. It's fast, healthy, and perfect for a balanced breakfast. Even your friends will ask you to teach them how to make this breakfast because it is really delicious. You won't regret trying it. I like to eat with a little coffee, but you can use the drink you prefer. It has become one of my favorite options since I first tried it. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Thank you so much for watching this video so far. I'll see you in the next video, bye.